Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Well, pretty much every time out in the UFC DC, this man has put on a striking clinic and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on the floor. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge of the striking game, the ability to set traps, the ability to find the jab, the ability to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbows. He truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal to try and finish his opponents. You make one mistake, night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yeah. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. It's a Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 240 pounds. Fighting out of Irvine, California, Assassin. And now, because he's opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, just make it official. Ready. Ready to fight? All right, crowd getting excited as this fight gets underway. And Specialist. But on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true five-tool play. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Outstanding kick there by Lee. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Well, you saw the tail of the tape. He has a reach advantage and made good use of it there with that punch. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Lee's kick attempt, that one was blocked. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow oh. this? He's getting lit up right now, John. He's got him hurt here.
so a good job defensively by him here. Oh, oh he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, is that a big knee to the body? We'll see if he can follow up. Gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Beautiful hit. Oh, is that a good knee to the body there by Lee? As he gets close, he's out of the kicking range, but so he'll change his stance. Oh, nice land with the knee. You see the taller fighter having no issue getting the limb to the target there. All right, throws a straight punch and lands, so that is increasingly becoming an effective weapon for him tonight. This is one of his best strikes, and he's throwing it over and over. Oh, big knee! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Back to the... Oh! Huge right hand! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, big left hook there! Nice shot moving off the center line. He slips to avoid that right hand. Nice kick. Final seconds. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Trying to hammer that big leg. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Ooh. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Connects with a right. Oh, oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Another punch to the head. He's really turning every part of himself into those strikes to the head. Man, has he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two. Definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Oh, that's a good right hand. That one's stuck in. Nice strike. Whoa! Oh, he gets back up, but barely. Look how wobbly he is. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Able to check that kick as well. Whoa! And just like that, the fight is over. Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight.
Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. So there he is as the celebration continues. A huge knockout for him here tonight. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop this contest at three minutes, 55 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by Knockout Assassin. Oh, there he is after a huge knockout win tonight. You've only after Thank you for watching. Please wait for more videos. See you soon.